Hey there, hi there, Pisces, and welcome to your monthly reading. This is the month of December reading for you, okay? We have the Dove energy here. Feel and allow a deeper sense of peace to fill you now. This is a divine quality. We also have the Mother card, which is the overall theme here. And we have Etain, the goddess of uh, light, shining one, Celtic goddess, okay? So... Let's see, let's see what is going on in the world of Pisces. Mm. Let's see here, let's get some cards here. So I see here vision, okay? So you have some sort of vision here, I feel like, of your future. We after we also have here a solstice. Okay. And we also have here touch. Okay. So there's vision, touch, and solstice. All right. So let's see what's going on here. Yes, we have your strength. We have knight of coins. We have your page of coins, okay? So I feel like for some of you, your mother uh, was somebody who did not have a vision for your future. Um, I feel like she just was not a visionary, but you are a visionary. You do have a lot of hope for the future. And therefore, um, you're very artistic and you're a very creative person. Um, I see here with the page of, co of coins, young but grounded, solid beginning, strong foundation, thrift shop. Yeah, for a lot of you, you're, you're very artistic and you can like find a lot of creative ideas. Like even just going to a thrift shop, you can like get really cool ideas and inspiration. English. Okay. So that's really interesting. And then also I feel like for a lot of you, you have like such this immense strength here. Like you have courage, you have um, overcoming and you have control over your life. Like you've had to overcome a lot of obstacles, but you really have done so. And um, I feel like for a lot of you, your mothers were not like a very strong character in your life. Um, also you have a uh, knight of points here, slow down here, right? It says responsible, consistent, hardworking. Yeah, you are a very responsible person, okay? Like you don't really, you don't believe in like, um, like other people like getting away with like, you know, like speeding too fast in a construction zone, right? Like we all know those types. You're one of those people that can like be a leader and hold up a sign and say, you know, now is the time to slow down and like, it's okay to enjoy life. It's okay to have a vision of where you want to go. And you can see here with the touch. Okay. This is like just a very strong, like foundation here. Like you have built serious roots here in your life. Um, I feel like for some of you, you are mothers or you're a motherly type. And, um, therefore you're really good at grounding yourself and, um, touching the lives of people around you. Like you are meant to inspire people and you are meant to show people like what the possibilities are, what the endless possibilities are, because you have this like vision you're able, like, I feel like for some of you, you have psychic abilities and you're able to see the future ahead and predict the future and like kind of just manifest where you want to go and what you're meant to do. And I feel like you have a vision of the future and you can see here with the eye and the tear, like a lot of tears have been shed over like what you want to do and where you want to go and like how to get there. I feel like you did not have all the support you needed, but despite Despite that, you still manage to succeed in this, like, beautiful, flowery, like, growth and energy of, like, your own garden almost. And you literally hold the key to success here in your own life. And you're able to share those keys, like, those little secrets to success 
um, with others as well, okay? And that is your divine quality this month. And I want that to just give you a sense of peace. Like, you don't need to feel like you need to prove to anybody that you're worthy of love or you're worthy of acknowledgement or you're worthy of recognition. You already are able to recognize yourself. You're already able to feel um, peace within yourself. Okay, and that is something that is the divine quality because a lot of people spend their entire lives trying to appease others when they don't even stop to try to take the time to take care of themselves. Okay, so that's what you need to do this month is really think, okay, I actually am like a loving, caring, nurturing person and I have a lot of wisdom to share and um, I can touch a lot of lives in a good, meaningful, positive way. And you have so much strength, okay? You have so much courage here to do that. And that's just by being your true, like, authentic self. Like, you can even see here that, like, they are, like, just chilling with their cat, like, you know, at home, like, work from home, right? Like, they're not, like, they aren't, like, oh, I gotta be, like, so, like, methodical and analytical and like so like logical all the time I can have a like just let go and be my true self and still have strength in that and courage and being myself and just like chilling <laughs> like it's okay to just chill sometimes um and then you have here the page of coins again you know she's holding up this really cool shirt with a pentacle on it right um, and she's like, look what I found at the thrift store. Like, this is amazing. This is like what I love. This is the kind of cool stuff I love. She didn't have to go all extravagant and spend hundreds of thousands of dollars on like merch. She just like went to a thrift shop and some other witch before her was like, I'm going to donate this. Um, I, you know, I, I don't need this shirt anymore and I'm going to donate it to like the next broke witch that comes along. Okay. So you're very thrifty when it comes to like stuff like that. Um, and also we have here the solstice, okay? You know, winter is here and, um, it's a time where, you know, we're in more darkness than we are with light, but it's okay to still, you can still shine bright, right? You can see these like different shades of blues and then under here you have the summer, right? So even in the winter time, we can see still like have fun and we can still celebrate things like the solstice and we can still enjoy company with others watching movies things like that so I want you to just think about that and manifest that for yourself okay like you can just have fun even even in like not so great times like money's tight or holidays are stressful or you know there isn't the summery days where we can go outside and like take really long summery walks and smell fresh flowers like we can still do indoor fun activities okay and you have this beautiful vision for yourself and I feel like for a lot of you, you do have to nurture yourself and mother yourself more than those that say do have a mom that already does that for them but that's like just that's just something that like think of it as like you were born to um, learn how to nurture yourself so then you can then nurture others and teach others how to do that who might be going through the loss of a mom that never existed or the loss of a mother that stopped being nurturing, right? So you can be like, well, you don't have to just be sad about it. You, you don't have to be depressed about it. You can still, um, move forward and enjoy life. Okay. Now, I'm going to pull some uh, moon cards for you here. Yeah, we have hope is rising, okay? Hope is rising, okay? You are meant to be filled with a sense of hope and a sense of peace, okay? Also, loneliness is just a normal part of life, okay? It's okay to feel lonely at times. It's okay to be alone with your thoughts and ideas. What better company than your own like vision for yourself and your own creativity and you know doing the things you like to do like if you're able to just talk to yourself for hours <laughs> like that Miley Cyrus song um, she can buy herself flowers she can talk to herself for hours she has learned to just love and appreciate being with herself instead of finding another friend or dating another person to like occupy her time she's instead learning to enjoy time alone okay 
stay positive and optimistic beautiful okay you are a beautiful soul you are a beautiful person so stay positive stay optimistic enjoy life see what it has to offer um, I'm gonna pull some everyday witch cards page of wands Okay, we have um, Four of Swords, and we also have here the Hanged Man. Okay, so the Four of Swords, the Page of Wands, and the Hanged Man. Okay, so for a lot of you, like, this is now a time for you to, like, rest and recover and prepare for... Uh, what's to come in the future, okay? For a lot of you, you have already gone through the tides and seasons of life that have transformed you and manifested you into this beautiful being that you now are. So it's okay to lay down and rest and relax and just like rejuvenate yourself. And Page of Wands energy, this is somebody like coming into your life that is walked a very similar journey to your, to your spiritual and me like mentally and they um are coming towards you okay this is like a possible um love interest um you know someone who is like on the same journey as you pretty much and just wants you to know that like they're there with you okay and you also have the hanging energy okay this is an energy of someone who um basically like when 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 you feel like you are tied up and you can't move and you can't be yourself and you can't express yourself the way you want to this person like is a bully and they try to hold you down and even though they try to restrain you from being yourself and even though they try to um like bully you into like being less like extravagant or less emotional or less like your creative self or try to stifle you in some way or scare you to being yourself and protecting yourself um you are able to just just chill and be like good luck with that because you hold the key to unlocking those chains yourself they keep trying to put chains on you i feel like this is like a past um relationship with someone um and i feel like in the past they tried to chain you down and keep you down like emotionally and mentally and just like drain you and just to like paint a bad picture of you and lock you away like out of their thoughts and just like put you somewhere unpleasant and you hold the key to your own freedom so no matter what they said to you no matter what they did to you to try to hurt you um, and paint you in a bad way you already know who your true self is you already have a vision of yourself you already love yourself and you can unlock those chains anytime you want so whenever they throw those like toxic energies to you think of the chains as like toxic energies whenever they try to throw those toxic energies towards you you just be like up oh, I got the key so no matter what you throw at me I can just unlock those chains and just throw them away because the truth is you can you can only let people control you so much before you're like realize oh, I need to stop telling like letting people, other people tell me what to do and bully me and stuff and you can just unlock those chains and just be like bye <laughs> like no thank you I got a life to live here I got a path and journey and destiny to fulfill here I'm trying to manifest wealth and abundance for my family here so um hope is is rising here okay keep the strength keep the courage okay take time to let that peace fill you and restore you and give you your divine quality okay positive optimistic beautiful that's what you have you have the ability to touch people's life and show them the endless possibilities okay and that's what you're doing okay you're doing that through touching them like through life like like just like sharing your thoughts and ideas it's just like and 
and your words of wisdom that like can transform someone's life somebody who is like held back by like bullying or betrayal and they don't know how to move past it and they don't know what to do because they feel like so upset about it you're able to touch their life and be like here slow down let's take some time to gather our strength to take ownership of our lives and to restore ourselves and become the beautiful amazing people we were born to be and regardless of what anyone says or does to us we still have friends on our side that are on this path with us that are here to help us and you know it's okay to be alone sometimes it's part of life and it just is going to teach us how we can love ourselves all right so thank you so much for watching love and light always bye